I'm a research officer within the PSSIU and uh, my role is mainly to carry out uh, economic analysis of both the financing and the provision of uh, long-term care. Uh, I work on two large uh, Department of Health funded uh, projects, CORE and ESCREW. Uh, there's more information on the website on those. A particularly interesting research project that we're working on is focused on informal carers. And uh, informal carers are people who provide care to a frail elderly individual or a disabled person in the home of the user. And uh, this can vary from anything uh, such as uh, helping out a couple of hours a week with shopping to providing uh, literally around the clock care. And what the research has found is that uh, depending on the intensity of the care provided, um, informal carers can suffer both mental and physical health effects. And uh, I think that we're particularly looking at here is whether this ultimately leads to a change in the uh, life expectancy of informal carers. Um, this issue is also very, very policy relevant. Um, Long-term care is most often provided by informal carers and this is not only typical in the UK but across Europe and uh, to ensure that the situation of informal carers is uh, sustainable and to alleviate any stress is something where um, local authorities has a great role to play and uh, part of our analysis is trying to see what different types of schemes and policies can help um, create a sustainable situation for informal carers.